Hi everyone, the Spider-Man here again. Well, as you can see, it's that time again. It's time to feed my scorpions. Uh, as you can see in the video, there is uh, eight scorpions in the video. So I've got three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And I've got another three down there. Uh, at the top is my Antidotinus Crusoda, my uh, Babacurious Witness, and my lovely Deathstalker. Now, the thing is with um, scorpions, they like to hide in their little burrows and all sorts. So for me to show you the, the, the attack, I have to lift uh, the cork bark. So obviously if I don't, then you're not going to see the attack. So let's just put my camera down there. There we go. Sorry, guys, and my. Uh... Oh, they dropped my bloody phone. They dropped my phone on the floor then. Ah, there we go. So, the first up is going to be this one here, which I'm not going to uh, pronounce. <laughs> a bit of a strange name. So let's just open the lid and let's just try to see if I can find it anyway. Ah, there it is. <laughs> Couldn't see it then, didn't know where it was. Right then, let's get my tongs and give it a black cricket here we go when I took the lid off I thought the actual um, scorpion had escaped by thinking and it can't escape because the air holes are that um, small anyway but scorpions don't really um, eat much anyway so this one don't seem to be hmm. that one don't seem to be that interested at the moment but I'll put the lid on and if it does eat I will um, put it in the description so I'll just put one of my feeding diaries there and what I'll do is, if I put it on its side just slightly, then it just tips up the um, the enclosure a little bit, so you can all see. So this one is the P. Uh, transvesculus. There you pronounce it. So let's just take the lid off that one. Ah, there it is, just there. So let's just. Put some food in. Here goes everyone. Oops. I'll put that one back out. The only problem with um, crickets this small is that when you pick them up with the tongs, you go watch you don't kill them. Let's just set the uh, the hide out so you can all see the attack. Hopefully, anyway. It's got a lot bigger than uh, than it was before. Well, I think it malted probably around about uh, two or three weeks ago. Oh, there we go. First attack of the day. That took nearly five minutes. <laughs> Got its meal, so that one's okay. Let's put the hide back on. 
uh, let it just enjoy its meal. Uh, next up is going to be my Al Njiri. So let's just take the lid off that one. See this one? It's fairly big. There it is, just set. Trouble with these scorpions, sometimes they actually uh, play dead sometimes. So let's just put that in there. Let that enjoy its meal. Uh, next up is my B. Jackson eye. Now this one is a bit difficult to see in its enclosure because it's the same um, colour as the actual substrate. So it can be a bit uh, difficult to see but uh, I think you can see that. There it is just, just there. So let's just put some food in for you guys. Oops, I think I... Oh, no, I didn't. Oh, there we go. There we go. Uh, there's the... There's the scorpion just there, nice. B Jackson I hope this one's well with with scorpions I don't really mind if they're um male or female I'm not too that bothered about that uh, see with scorpions it can really be a, a bit of a hit and miss if they if they actually eat or not um most of the time they don't really eat because they don't really do much to be honest um they just sit there really so uh this one is my you chubby let's have a look at that one should be on the court bucket there it is just there oops <laughs> keeps going under its court bark um yeah a bit difficult really to try and get an attack on scorpions really um all that all they like to do is just hide under their court bark really uh, there it is just there nah. so yeah, that's the trouble with scorpions they don't really oh i think it's after it's dinner uh, yeah, it's got it. It's got it in its uh, in its pincer there. Look, so that one's eaten as well, which is good. That's that one fed. Um, hopefully after the new year, I'm gonna get gonna get myself a a decent camera, and then I can actually cut out and edit edit the video a lot better. This is my H. Tamalius, which is a fairly uh, big scorpion to be fair. This one's probably around about the inch and a half to two inch from uh, claw to tail. Get some, get some food for you guys. Here we go. Oops. There we go. Another attack for you guys. So not doing too bad. Let's put that back in there. So let's just put the lid on. I haven't fed them for a while. So 
they do need a feed this one is my Androductinus species nose this one's only a little a little tiny uh, tiny scorpion not very big so good job I've got some small crickets so hopefully it might take it down don't really seem to um, eat much to be fair but um, I hope you're all having a nice uh, start to the weekend I don't really seem to um, eat as much but what I'll do is I'll just uh, I'll leave the cricket in there so it might uh, might just might grab it a bit later so I have to be quick with my videos just in case the uh, my memory runs out but I'll do this one um, last and then um, I'll feed my my bigger scorpions a little bit later so this is my uh, my H Jakara. This one is a fairly big species, probably about a two and a half inch. Absolutely um, stunning scorpion. So let's just get a black cricket. Here goes everyone. It does usually um, does usually feed. Absolutely stunning, stunning scorpion. It does. Gonna be absolute stunning when he gets a uh, a little bit bigger. But um, yeah, I'm sorry I have to um, take the hide out. Obviously, you're not gonna see the attack. So there's not much I can do there. But um, yeah, I had a few attacks, but not many. So let's just put the hide back in, in there like that. So that was my feeding all my little baby scorpions and a few sub-adults. And thanks for watching, everyone.